Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And somebody just a few minutes ago emailed me, and they're using X7, which I very seldom use. And if my voice sounds a little funny, it's because I'm doing it on a laptop. My X7 will not work on my normal computer that I make the videos at. But they were had watched a video on Docker's and the object property, and the person was showing outlines. Well, there's really no outlines because this is a font. You can see it's Arial. So what you have to do is click on your item, turn your object into a curve. Now your object property comes up with an outline. We can make our outline two points. And here's what her question was because she'd watched the video, and this is pretty neat. I've really never used it. Right now it's set on center outline. You could go to outside outline, and it makes your, it, it's putting the outline on the outside of your field. Then you can actually go to inside. So it's, it's making, it's basically making it smaller, but if you really know what it's doing, it's just changing the outline. So let's just do this. Let's take the, let's get it back to center, and let's take our, uh, parallel dimension tool and let's measure from there to there is 0.23 now we're going to go inside outline I don't have it checked or selected now it's split the difference we're bigger than uh, because it was on the center now it's put it to the outside let's put it to the inside and now it's that same distance off it's a pretty cool tool. These are these are just in X7. They've added these three. Normally you just have these six plus all this other stuff. And the outline properties is pretty cool. I mean, you can change the you know the color of the of the the fill. Have no fill. Change it back to yellow. Anyway, I hope that helped them a little bit. And thank you for watching. Just keep in mind when you're trying to use, so under Windows, Docker's property, this will not come up unless it's an object. It's not a font anymore. So there's where she was having her problems. Hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.